Scorpio. Thank you for being so patient with me. I love you, love you, love you. Mwah, mwah, mwah. We're gonna do your reading with my new cards I got for Christmas. They are Osho Zen cards and they're super hot and I can't wait to start your reading. Okay, so very first off Libra Scorpio, your person has had like a serious problem with control and all of a sudden I was getting money. So like they want to control income, the income, maybe you in your relationship, they wanted to control the income. Maybe they wanted to take uh, money from you at times um, when you were in a relationship or they wanted to control all the money. Like they, they petered it out to you as if you were on an allowance, right? Um, but I am seeing pos postponement with the control. So... What I'm seeing here is someone coming to their senses and like realizing, oh my gosh, I was kind of an asshole by trying to control. And they feel a lot of guilt about this. Like whatever enlightenment they've had about being in control and, and, um, you know, it may not have been money. It could have been anything. But I was getting money. Um, anyways, they feel really guilty about this. And we have success. So you, Libra Scorpio, are very successful. And whatever your endeavor is, whatever money you're applying to yourself or whatever you're doing you are doing a great job and you're extremely successful and they're thinking about your success so they're trying to postpone their control and guilt because they know they were kind of an eh, right um but i don't see apologies here i don't see i'm sorry i just so in their heart They have like had this realization. Look at you see the thunderbolt. They're like zapped, like oh, right. That they are holding on to the past. That they've been holding on to the past, like, and that this has caused them to fall. Do you see those two people falling? They're just falling, falling into like an endless pit of despair. And your person. And do you see, um, it looks like a Picasso painting almost over their head. They're just so jumbled with all of these things from the past that is making them crazy. I also think that they, they realized that the control and the guilt and all of it, like maybe they even postponed a relationship with you or something and they feel guilty about that because of of money or success at their work at the time and they're just clinging to all this and they're realizing it's a waste of time because you have moved on and this is their thunderbolt they're stuck in this see how this painting is over this person's head in this jumble of thoughts and they had this sudden realization that you've moved on. They're also really um, blown away by the ability that, you, uh, how receptive you are with abundance. And I was going to show you guys this too. Um, I was going to show you guys the abundance stone. Um, that was what I was led to um, bring for the whole over your reading. And then the card I pulled was abundance. So you guys, if you're not abundant yet, you're going to be <laughs> okay. Just saying abundance, abundance. All right. And you're so receptive. You see how this flower is blooming and she's pulling in all the elements from the water, the air, the earth. And it's a feminine energy, right? And she's just bringing it all into herself and becoming this beaming ball of light. That's what you guys are. Male or female, you have the capacity to beam out this 
bright light from within your heart chakra area, right? Because um, even males have feminine energy. It's the yin yang. It's balancing the two of those, right? So you are very receptive, whether you're female or male, in balancing your yin and yang. And this is making you blossom and bringing in so much abundance. So much abundance, okay? And your person is like literally having a thunderbolt over all this, like tower moment or us. And what they plan to do about it, they're actually really trying intensely. Look at this. They are intensely trying to mature. They know that the way they behaved in the past was very immature, very childish, ridiculous, right? Ridiculous. Okay. Um, and they are intensely trying to grow quickly from this. Um, but they have very little patience, okay? We've got burden and patience um, together. So it's like they're frustrated with themselves because they can't be on your level or on your frequency the, the way that you are. And what they don't understand is that it took years for you to become who you are. It didn't happen overnight, baby. Many, many, many moons. Many, many, many ego deaths. Enough to learn that all the glory goes to the Creator and not to us. And to be very careful to not take it, you see. And then, and then you got on the bottom of the deck, go with the flow and source. So I believe that you do flow with the divine. You walk with the divine. And, um, you know, when you feel led to do something, you do it. When you feel led to say something, you say it. And that's all um, something that your person is thinking about. And then, you know, they like, they may be having dreams about you. And in the your dream in their dreams, they may be seeing the courage that it took for you to like overcome some of the things that you've overcome in your life that they've never really thought about. And this may be bringing them into even more respect for you in some way. Um, but yeah, that's your reading, Libra Scorpio. I hope you enjoyed it, and I love these cards. Aren't they amazing? <laughs> Merry Memory.